Hi, welcome back to Easy Moto Tim and our California Adventure Vlog. Day 10 of our trip is the first day of the convention. Beth attended the welcome meeting in the morning and then helped out in the supply room. It turns out that the woman who was in charge of supplies was in an accident and broke her leg uh, as she left Florida. So others have been helping out um, manning the supply room during the convention. The Biggs Harley Davidson hog chapter invited us to join them on a ride on this first day of the convention. And so several of the men joined up. And the ride took us up over the mountains to the coast and down I-5 along the coast and then back in and loop back up to Temecula. Had a nice time. It was a great ride, 140 miles. In the late afternoon, the women got dressed in their uniforms and assembled in the resort's theater for a group picture. Then they rode their bikes to a staging area uh, at the Harley-Davidson dealership and then rode in a parade into downtown Temecula. I took a video of the parade and you can see that elsewhere on my channel. After the parade, we met with some friends from home and went to dinner together in Old Town Temecula. Day 11 of our trip and day 2 of the convention was the Dot Robinson Road Rally. Now I'll try to explain this road rally. It's a course of 75 miles and the riders have to average 30 miles an hour. There are five or six hidden checkpoints and they need to be on time on that 30 mile an hour average. When they get to a checkpoint they get two points deducted for every minute that they're early or one minute one point for every minute that they're late. And the points are deducted from a total of 1,000 points. Riders meet at 6 a.m. to get their starting time and to participate in Pajama Rama. Prizes are given for the most outlandish pajamas worn. This year, there weren't very many outlandish pajamas. Riders leave the starting point at one minute intervals. Each rider is given a number. Each rider is given turn-by-turn -turn directions for the route. You got your list all ready to go? My what? Your list. Your route. Yeah. Pretty much. You need this. The starter gives the countdown to the minute, and off she goes. Turns out, Beth lost 14 points. It was a really tough uh, course, but she ended up in third place in the A class. While Beth was out riding, I worked on videos and the blog, and we took the afternoon off, then uh, had dinner and strolled around the pool and spa area. Day 12 of our adventure and the third day of the convention. We got up about 6.30 and went to McDonald's for breakfast. Afterwards, we went to the grocery store and stocked up on some supplies for our picnic lunches. Beth went to the business meeting in the morning. It was uncharacteristically short. It went from 8.30 to 11. There was nothing to vote on this year so it was a shorter meeting. After lunch, we went to the Moto Dafa Winery. They have a collection of antique motorcycles, so we went to see the motorcycles. And here are a bunch of pictures and videos from our trip to the winery. 
We're at the Moto Dolfo Winery and Motorcycle Museum. And they've got a lot of old motorcycles on display here. There's a whole lot of Vespas. When we got back from the winery, we went to the pool and this time we actually swam. It's a resort pool for sure. This evening is the banquet and I'll include that story in another video.